Today is July 17th, 2013. I'm Andre Zakow. I've been making this show for the past three months. This is Speedrun. The THQ bankruptcy saga has come to a close. Bloomberg reports the former video game publisher and its liquidation plans approved by a Delaware court, which will see THQ's lengthy list of creditors receive payment from the liquidation of the publisher's assets. The company's creditors will receive somewhere between 20 and 52% of the amount owed, depending on the amount of their claim and other factors, and total claims range from $143 million to $184 million. THQ's European subsidiary submitted $107 million in claims, and if that's allowed, it could lower the overall payout percentage. The NCAA is breaking up with Electronic Arts. The football organization won't renew its contract with EA for the publisher's long-running NCAA college football video game series. EA's current licensing agreement with the NCAA, which is an exclusive contract, expires in June 2014. And it looks like NCAA Football 14 will be the last officially licensed college football game with the NCAA name. We've got not one, but three new previews up. Developer Big Robot Sir, You Are Being Hunted is a terrifying trip to an abandoned island where players are hunted down by tea-drinking, mustachioed gentlemen robots out for your blood. WayForward's new Adventure Time game, Adventure Time, Explore the Dungeon, because I don't know, was inspired by Diablo, according to its developers. The game will feature a new storyline with your favorite heroes, more than 100 explorable dungeons, and four-player co-op. And the regular show game for 3DS, Mordecai, and Rigby in 8-bit land is a side-scrolling shoot-'em-up that also combines platforming and top-down exploration. Cartoon characters that sing about butts and killer British gentleman robots. I'm not sure which one I'm more unnerved by. What happens when American and European teams of StarCraft players form a supergroup to tackle the most competitive StarCraft league in Korea? Team Liquid and Evil Geniuses, two of the most prominent non-Korean StarCraft teams, join forces to compete in the oldest, most elite StarCraft team league. Taking part in Pro League proved too much, however, and this dream team found themselves defeated at almost every turn in the early part of the season. Hoping to salvage their credibility, the teams hired one of the most renowned coaches in the esports community, Park Young-Woon, to help the team hone their skills and compete at such a high level. The training proved more rigorous than the teams could have imagined, and regardless of the outcome, helped change how they played the game. Read our full feature to see how Park shaped these two teams to compete on such a challenging level. Speaking of eSports, we got a pretty sweet gallery of photos taken at EVO 2013 last week. Shout out to Polygon's own DZ, who managed to capture the passion of the fighting games community and the splendor of the event for the rest of us who couldn't make it. That's it for me, not for you. Stay tuned tomorrow for more episodes of Speedrun. Have a good night, Polynots.